Hello everyone, welcome back to the Cherry Tips and in this video we are going to talk about how to fix Returnal is having audio sound is not working or it is crackling or it is muffled and popping audio which is issue on your Windows PC or laptop and how we can fix this out. So let's dive into it. First one, you just have to do a simple restart. That is what you have to do. For doing a simple restart, you just have to go over here in the search, click on this icon, go for a restart. After successfully doing a restart, check whether the issue is fixed or not. If that is not working, we have to move to next one. That is all about, you have to check the volume mixer. For that reason, you just have to go over here in the search, go to settings. Now from here, you just have to go to, over here you have to go to sound. Now from here, as you can see, you have to make sure that is uh, the volume is being set into 100%. As you can see on the both the output as well as on the input, the volume is not muted. It is 84 and it is 100 vice versa. So it is not muted. It is having good, uh, in, uh, I mean, the volume is being set into good. So this is what you have to do. So uh, this is going to work as well. So this is the step. You have to make sure it is not being set into muted or something. So which can even simple uh, mistake can cause a big issue. So you just have to make sure this is not the case. Moving to the next one is all about, you have to select the right audio device in the sound setting. So here we are already in the uh, sound setting. So from here, we just have to check. We have to select the speaker. If that is the case, you have to select the respective one that is Realtek R Audio. So if you're on the microphone, as you can see here also, I have selected the correct one that is Realtek R Audio. So in the both the thing, I have taken same that is Realtek R Audio, which means that I have selected the correct uh, speaker. So if it is having any mistake, so definitely that is going to fix the issue as well. So if it is selected wrong, then not you will not be having any kind of audio or you'll be having a lot of audio issue. So this is what you have to do as it is. Moving to the next one is all about, you have to set the sound sample rate to 48 or 44 kilohertz in the sound control panel. For that, we just have to go over here in the search, search for control panel, open this. Now from here, you have to go to sound. Now from here, you have to select the respective speaker, select it, right click, go to properties go over here on the levels sorry advance it and over here under default format you have to set this to 24 bit you have to select this one so you're having four option that is 16 bit 4400 hertz 16 bit 4800 hertz 24 bit 4400 hertz and 24 bit 4800 hertz so you have to select the respective one that is correct one that is 24 bit 48 hertz then go for ok then try to play the game and you can see the differences this is what you have to do Moving to the next one, after trying all these things, if it's not working, do not panic. We have a few more steps which you can try out. And the next one is all about what you have to do is you just have to go for disconnect the controllers. That in the sense, if any controllers are connected, for example, if you're trying to play the game with joystick or Xbox and all those things, even the uh, Logitech game wheels and all those things, which is not suited to this. But even though you'll be having a lot of things, right? So I just eject everything from the USB port. That means you have to eject everything from the USB port. After it's been successfully ejected, you have to connect it back. I mean, launch the game. After the game is launched successfully, just connect it back and try to play the game. And that is going to work as well. This did work for many users. So just disconnect the drive connectors, launch the game, connect it back and try to play the game. That is going to work as well. Moving to the next one is all about, you have to turn off spatial sound. For that reason, we just have to go to over here in the search, go to control panel, navigate to sound. Now from here, select the respective speaker, right click and go to properties, go to spatial sound. Here, here will be make sure that is it's turn it off. Turning off is very important. So you have to turn it off. It is turn it on. Then just go for OK, then close everything, close everything and go back to the game. Try to launch it again. Next one is all about you have to disable the Oculus voice meter. So that can be done, which is quite easy. So just go over here. Go to control panel once again go to sound now from here as you can see here the speakers is marked correct but rest things are not correct right so here you will be getting oculus voice meter if it's already connected so just end the task so if you don't know how to eject it just select it then go for disable it so disable the oculus voice meter not the speaker go to or navigate to oculus and disable it and this is how we can do this after that, try to play the game and that is did, that did work for many users as well. Go to the next one that is all about, you have to disable unwanted things from the device manager. In the sense, you just have to go over here in the start, right click and go to device manager. Now go over here on the 
over here you have to go to the sound and video so here the realtek r audio is mine which is i'm using and this is my speaker so apart from this we are having two that is nvidia high definition audio nvidia virtual audio device you can just eject this and uh, i mean you can select this and go for disable the device keep only speaker which is necessary and that is what we have to do move to the next one is all about we have to move to the next one that is all about you have to install audio drivers so that can be done or you can update the driver for that you just have to right click and go to over here on device manager now go to the device over here on the sound then select the realtek r audio then right click and go to update driver go for search automatically drivers and you can see this up to date you have to update it that is what you have to do Moving to the next one is all about you have to update the windows and this did work at like uh, for many users as well. So for that just go over here and go to settings over here. Go to windows update at the bottom left. Now from here just update the windows and after updating the window that's going to work as well. So here there are many updates just update everything and after that try to play the game and that's going to work. So these are the possible workarounds which you have to try out when you're having an issue with returnal audio is having an issue and how it can fix this up. And I hope this video is helpful and if you find this video helpful, don't forget to subscribe and click on the bell icon for more notifications. See you soon in the next video. Peace out. Bye-bye.